I'm from a neutral country, and I'm really back this time. I mean, uh, last time I said I was back, I made one video about saying I was back, and then it took a year, and <laughs> a year has passed, and I'm back. No, I'm back again. Last time I was back. Oh, uh, yeah. I actually got my keyboard. What happened last time was um, I uh, had to move, and so I lost a lot of equipment, and I had with school and all, I just didn't bother getting it back or recovering it. And now I've been thinking about making a new video for like months, but uh, I didn't find a cable, so I just went and bought a new one. Whoopie doo, that worked. And uh, but for this, uh, it's gonna be of course a video for my subscribers. I'm not gonna talk about any. Thing particular, I, actually I am. I'm gonna address the questions I got in the last video, which I promised I was going to answer, and hey, I'm answering them now. Um, why do I have flags in the background uh, always? Well, right now we can see the good old American flag and the old Dixieland flag. Um, why do I have? I don't know. I like flags. That's about it. I mean, I really like flags. What they represent, the history behind them. Um, how flags just come and go, you know? Uh, the Soviet Union, a oh, great flag, or not great, it was just red with a hammer and sickle, but uh, it was a very prominent flag and now it's gone. And that's, I think flags are a good reputation of, a representation of how things come and get, go, and it gives voice to political ideals and that. Uh, I think it's real funny that some people get real offended when I use certain flags because I'm just gonna say I do not affiliate or I do affiliate with some of the flags but um, I just use random flags really um, the next question here um, uh, do I support the um, Iranians quest for nuclear technology. I don't support it, but I don't resent it. I mean, they're within the rights they have, uh, as far as I know, been like uh, they have uh, followed the UN regulations. So well, now talks are in and all that's good. The only thing we need to make sure is that it isn't used for nuclear weapons because god knows we do not need more nuclear weapons in the world at all ever no just get rid of them um uh, yes israel has a lot of bombs and that's obviously a problem i wish we could get rid of the israel bombs and really if iran gets a bomb i think it will help the Middle Eastern uh, uh, countries to resist the bullying that has been going on from Israel. Um, but of course, I don't think Iran is, or it's the most stable of the Middle Eastern uh, regimes, so I guess. But really it's a hard question, and uh, as long as they use it for peaceful, I don't see any problem with that. Um, do I like tomatoes? No, I. Well, I enjoy tomatoes, of course. Um, let us see. Next question is... Uh, uh, do the Americans uh, have any progress on gay marriage issues? Of course, this was before a lot of the new states uh, recognized it. And I think... And of course, long before Barack Obama <coughs> said his support. But yeah, the American... I mean, it's like the civil rights issues... It's like all the civil rights issues, it always moves forward, it, it rarely goes backwards. Unless you're in a backwards state. Because <laughs> those are backwards, and then it moves backwards. Logical. Um, let us see. Am I a Muslim? I am uh, not a Muslim at all, actually. Um, I am not... I'm not affiliated with any religious religions, and really, religion is too hard of a subject to wrap my mind around, take a stance, so many religions, uh, so little evidence, all that. I'm not saying that I'm an atheist, but I'm saying I do not adhere to any religion 
at this point. Um, yes, another are you a Muslim? What Norwegian political party do you support and why? Uh, I'm actually a member of a political party in Norway, um, left, the left party, um, which is the social liberal party on the right side of politics. Yeah, no, left, but on the right side. It's named left, it's on the right, it's so confusing, but it's social liberalism. Um, I guess Americans aren't too familiar with the social liberalism stamp, uh, but I'm not gonna go into a too too much about the liberal social liberalism really. Um, uh, are am I retarded? No, I'm not. And uh, Catholic Orthodox or Muslim? I'm neither. As I said, you know, I think it's funny that because I use like the Serbian and Bosnian flag and Croat flag. Um, a lot of people have affiliated with me, with me with those countries. I mean, they think I'm Croatian, they think I'm uh, Serbian. And when I have a Serbian flag, all the Croatian gets mad. And when I have a Croatian flag, all the Serbians get mad. And really, if you see some of my comment sections, there are a lot of uh, random, uh, where I feel is random, people just spouting out like, oh, Croatia sucks, or ah, oh, Serbia sucks. <laughs> and actually, because I don't have any more questions, I'll give you a little little something for the brain, uh, for you Croatian uh, Serbs out there. Um, really, that conflict is so confusing, and I, I'm uh, big on uh, Yugoslavian history, actually. That's one of my favorite history subjects, one of my favorite um, civil wars. <laughs> favorite civil war, but... Um, um, it's such hard questions, and really, I wish it. We were back to when it was just Yugoslavs instead of Croatian Serbs, Bosnian Croatians, Bosnian Serbs, Bosnian Muslims, and all that. It's it. It's such a shame. Shame to see a great country get ripped apart because of ethnic lines, really. But yeah, I'm back to making videos now, and um, I think my first one is going to be on American politics and the election, of course that is ongoing. This is me signing off.